video I'm going to show you how you can um, make it so that your Google Hangout can be viewed by people on your actual web page. So it could be a page on your website or on your blog. Um, so it means that people don't have to go over to Google Plus and they don't have to go to YouTube, they can just stay on your website. So the advantages of this are if people don't know how to use Google+, it's just one less barrier. So they can just be watching it where they're used to being able to interact, just going to your web page. It also means if you're uh, wanting to um, use a Hangout as part of a launch or something, you're keeping people actually on the pages where there's going to be your sales messages as well. So there's some great advantages to doing that. So let me show you how to do that. It's very, very quick. So what we've got is I've come over to here to the Google Hangout that I've set up in a previous video. And when we've set this up, you'll see it's got down here on the right hand side, it's got links. So I'm going to get two things from here. Number one is I'm going to get this video embed code. So I'm just going to copy on that. And I'm going to copy that. Now I'm going to go over to a web page that I've already made beforehand, one I prepared earlier. And I'm saying here, welcome to the Inner Circle Hangout. I've got a bit of a blurb here for people um, because this is actually for some clients. So I'm just explaining to them why we're having this hangout, what the purpose of it is. And I've also put here about how they can join me, that they can just click here and watch the video above. Or if they want to join me, I'm going to show them how they can come over and join me on Google+. Plus if they're um, pretty Google Plus savvy or want to become so. Uh, so what we're going to do here is we want to first of all see where I've typed in video. We're wanting to put our video so it actually shows there. So I'll show you how to do that first. Now here we go to the actual behind the scenes area. So this is this page behind the scenes. So this is what it looks like for me. Uh, when I'm creating this page. So you can see I've got all the content. Now see how I put video here? There's a good reason for putting that. I've written the word and I've put it in capital letters. The reason for that is when I go over here, so we're in visual, so this is what it looks like. If I go over into text, it's really easy for me to find where I wanted to put it. So I don't have to, you know, kind of spend too much time looking. So I'm just going to go on here, highlight that, delete it and then I'm going to paste that code that was given to me. That's it. Now I'm going to go back over here and you can see it's actually putting the video there. Now I'm also going to post something else here before we go over and I'll show you it, I'll show you the final page. Now when I did this, um, we'll just do a little quick edit while I'm here, I want that page there that to be a heading. So I've said here that if you want to join me behind the scenes, I'm saying pop over to here where the Hangout is. So I want to be able to sh take them over to that Hangout. So this is this other link. This is the event page. So I'm going to copy that link there. So see how we're back over here on Google+, Plus, which is the page that I've set up for the call. And that's going to give me that code there. That's the code there to uh, for people to be able to come to this actual page to watch it. So I'm going to go back over here and I'm going to link that here. Um, so I said pop over here to where the Hangout is. So I'm going to put that there. Go up here to where the link is and paste it. And I'll say open it in a new tab. There we go. Um, so that should be all done. Now I'm going to click here to say update that page and then we'll go over and we'll see what does the final page look like. Okay, so it's just saved it for me. Let's go back over here to see what it looks like for my clients. So this is the actual page and we're just going to refresh that now that it's the edits have saved and we'll see what the final page looks like. And here we are. So it's got welcome to the Hangout. It's got the video here. Um, if it clicks play, how cool is this? It's saying to stand by. This is in five days, 14 hours, 54 minutes. Um, so that's great. So when it goes when it goes live, they just have to click there. It'll go live. Pretty cool. And then over here, if we click on that, 
it should take people straight over to the event page. And here we are. Ta-da! Now, with this, it means that if people are coming over here to the event page, when I'm going behind the scenes, if they're leaving comments and questions, I can see that behind the scenes. Anything that they say here will come up. But importantly, because I'm wanting people to come to this page, I can keep this page open and I can just keep an eye to see if there are any comments that people are leaving. There you go. So that's how you embed a live Hangout to be able to go onto a page on your website. So you've got control over the environment where they're seeing it. The nice part about this is as soon as it is finished, you don't, this here, you don't have to change anything else. This will automatically be a replay of the Hangout. So it acts as you know, a, uh, a replay page as well. So how cool is that? Okay, so let me know if you have a go at doing this. I'd love to hear what kind of success you have. And please just come and leave me some comments. I'd love